Hey everybody. Hi. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? We're just sitting here today making videos and we were thinking of how we live in the South and what would the signs be if us as our hillbilly self or one of these other hillbillies around here hit the lottery? There'd be signs. There'd be signs. There'd be signs. So the first sign would be... I, I'd get me a pet pig. I'd have a little pet pig. In her house, and, probably. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And it would have its own little pet piggy door. It'd be bougie. Pet piggy uh, bed. And it'd probably have a little collar on that was like pink and sparkly and had had rhinestones. She'd be a rhinestone cowgirl. Yes. Yeah, she would, She's <laughs> not kidding, y'all. I'd have a pet pig. She'd have a pet pig. I might have multiple pet pigs. Probably. But if we get to that point, I gotta have a barn. If y'all see me get a barn and pigs, y'all know I've hit it. Yeah. I've hit it. Yeah. I've hit it. Mm -hmm. uh, a galvanized water feeder. You know, like the big round that you, that you water get a tractor the cows supply with. that you get a, that that's gonna be the new whirlpool. Yeah, Lisa and Lester will have that big, huge galvanized thing with water in it and they'll have a pump hooked up to it and they'll be sitting out in their front it's yard. It's a hot tub. It's uh -huh. a hot tub. Uh-huh. 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 <laughs> okay, now, if you hit the lottery out here, you're probably going to go ahead and put a tin roof on your trailer. Uh -huh. You know, if you got shingle, just you gonna, just get rid of that shingle you putting a tin roof on that trailer. Fancy. you getting fancy. Fancy. Mm -hmm. Now, my husband... I'm going to get him a winch for not only his truck, but for that Mustang, too. Mm -hmm. He's going to have a, a winch on that He's Mustang. He's going to have a winch on his truck and his Mustang. If you ever see a winch on that Mustang, you're going to They've hit the lottery. You know? They've hit the lottery. You know, because I ain't going to tell nobody. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You got your pontoon boat. You hit the lottery. You're putting a speed boat motor on. Mm -hmm. If you see us flying across the lake, in a pontoon, but we're going 100 miles an hour, we've hit it. Mm -hmm. We've hit it big. <laughs> and I'm going to bring, I'll, I'll, my washer won't be sitting on the front porch. Uh-uh. You br br now, We're going to build us a little Out room. here in the country, you're going you're gonna to have, you're going to do something to where you can bring that wash machine bring inside. Washing machine you in. ain't going to be washing out mm -hmm. on the porch no more. <laughs> you ain't going to do it. My washing machine ain't on the porch, by the way. <laughs> Mine ain't either, but we can say it. Either. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but we'll have a new couch on the front uh -huh, porch. Uh huh. You get your, or in your front yard. In your front yard uh -huh. under the shade tree or something. A little yeah, house I ride by on the way to work, and mm -hmm. you do too every day. That mm -hmm. man, I would, he had a chair, uh, like a cloth chair, sitting out there for the longest time, and he'd be sitting out there in it sometime when I go to work. So, um, yeah, you a lot of people around here have a, a couch in their front yard. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. On the porch, and front some, yard. Yep, yeah, and sometimes you might even see a billy goat sitting on it. Well, you never know. Mm -hmm. Never know mm -hmm. around here. All right, now, shade tree mechanics, hillbilly mechanics, they hit the lottery. They're going to have two, two cherry pickers in their front yard. Hanging not just, from a tree. From a tree, not just one. Not just they one. going to have a they double. They're going to have two. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, ain't gonna be no crack in the windshield of my 1989 grand damn mm -hmm, no more. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You got a crack in that windshield, mm -hmm. you're gonna have it, you're gonna get a whole new windshield. We call it glass pro. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You even, might even get a paint job. My Mako, we'll call Mako. Mm -hmm. Mako. Or and glass Billy Bob pro. does it in his garage exactly. down there. I can afford that now. Exactly. I can afford that now. And now you're gonna go and you're gonna upgrade grandma. Grandma's living in a single wide right now. You're going to get her a double wide. She's getting the big stuff. So if you see somebody's buying their grandma a double wide and pulling that single wide out, they've hit the lottery. Mm -hmm. they They'll probably it. pull it out on their truck. They might. I know somebody who done that. <laughs> I've seen it on a reel, but I didn't uh, know that. Like I've they hooked it. it to their regular truck. I've seen it. Mm. Okay. Oh. Uh, oh. You might need... When you get Granny her brand new double Y, she getting a new septic tank too. Mm -hmm. She getting a brand new septic tank. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Got to move it on she up. She getting it. She getting it. And we're gonna donate money to the church for indoor plumbing. It's about time the church gets an indoor bathroom. We're gonna make sure the church gets an indoor bathroom. The ladies and gentlemen will not have to go outside in the wintertime anymore mm -hmm. to the outhouse. To so the outhouse, no more mm -hmm. outhouse for. It's gonna them. happen. And all right now. I remember these. I had one of these when I was a kid, uh, but it wasn't that quite this big. But see, when you hit the lottery, 
you're going to take that old crushed velvet painting out from up over your fake fireplace and you're going to get you a 20 by 24 crushed velvet painting of Elvis. You have hit the big time. Uh, when you get that 20 by 24 crushed velvet of Elvis, uh -huh. you know you they've hit, hit the lottery. lottery. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and we're going to have Brand new ashtrays for the front porch. And not just ashtrays. Porcelain. Porcelain, porcelain ashtrays. Mm -hmm. We ain't gonna have to thump mm -hmm. our cigarette mm -hmm. ducts in the yard mm -hmm. no more. We gonna have a... They and go. it's gonna be on one of them high stands. Uh -huh. It's gonna be a porcelain uh -huh. ashtray up on one uh -huh. of them high stands. That's right. Mm -hmm. Yep. And you ain't gonna use an old toilet for grilling. You're gonna buy an actual grill. A grill, yeah. You're gonna a have charcoal a grill Real grill to cook on. Yes. Mm -hmm. You're gonna have it. Oh. And Lisa said if she hits the lottery, she's going to start shopping at Target, Target instead of the Walmarts. Mm -hmm. She's going to Target. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and you, that's a sign, y'all. Mm -hmm. Be watching for mm -hmm. it. And when you see her at Target, you know she's done it. And at, while we at the Target, mm -hmm. I'm going to get me a whole new set of mason, mason jar glasses. Yeah. You're going to take the old mason jars mm -hmm. that don't have the handles right. on them. Right. We got to have the handles. You're going to get rid of them and you're going to buy a whole set of mason mm -hmm. jars that have the little handle on mm -hmm. them because that's fancy living. Fancy life. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, fancy life. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There, there just be some signs, y'all. Those will be the signs. So if y'all see those things happening in our lives... Are the people who it's closest to us, then you know. Somebody's done hit that line. Somebody's logic. hit it. Uh, yeah. Somebody's hit it big. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But we want to know, yeah, what is your sign? What's going to be the one biggest sign that you have hit the lottery? Tell us what the it, what the biggest thing you would do uh -huh. your biggest, if you hit the lottery. Biggest, yeah. What you going to do? What's the immediate thing? Are you going to brick your single wide trailer? Are you what you gonna do? What you, you gonna, gonna do? get brand new tires for that big uh -huh, square body uh -huh. truck? You gonna do something? It's gonna be signs, and so let us know what your sign is if you gonna hit the lottery. Seriously, I would donate some money to some children. I always thought I Brenner's would, or St. Jude's. Yeah, because that's a serious thing, mm -hmm. and that would be one of the first things that I think I would see. In all seriousness, yeah. yes. Yeah. One of them. And uh, find a church that I really thought was doing a good job and making their community feel welcome and uh, really loving everybody in the community and probably help them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like a, a church that really goes out of the way to help the community. Yeah. So. But so it won't, I won't only just get a new septic tank. I'll be, I'll be giving some money away to yeah, So other people can get some septic tanks. <laughs> Bye, y'all. See y'all.